For cheap Minecraft hosting, be sure to go ahead and check out Clovex.net. What is going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video, I want to be showing you how to clear your skin in Photoshop. Now just before I get into this video, if you like to request a tutorial on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects, or even Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. So we've got this image here, I've got it from Google, and this guy has spots on his face, he's also got some dimples, we're going to get rid of them. So simply go ahead and drag the photo into Photoshop, and now make sure this is unchecked right here. Now this part is completely up to you. I'm going to duplicate the layer to show you the before and after. You can do the same if you want to. So just press Ctrl J on your keyboard or just right click it and click duplicate layer. Now I'm going to be working on the top layer so it shows up. So come to your magnifying tool and just zoom in to where you want to start. And the next thing you want to do is come to this right here. And as you can see, if you click and hold spot healing brush tool. Now here you can just change the size, make sure the hardness is on full, the space just leave it default. And as you can see you've got the mode here, keep it on normal, and then here you have the type. You can have content to wear, create texture, proximity match. Personally for this I'm going to be using create texture. I would suggest you stick to content to wear or create texture, or of course if none of them work you can try proximity match. So the next thing you do, simply just click and go over them, and as you can see the spots are already going. So hopefully you get what to do now, just literally left click, drag and go over it and do it in small strokes, this way it will give it a better effect and it won't like mess up your image. So I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward this now, it's very simple to do and I'll show you the final result when I'm done. Now just a very quick tip here. As you can see, if you go too close to the skin, you're going to get a smudge effect. Now the way you can actually go against this, if you zoom in all the way, and then go back to your healing tool, press the left bracket to make it smaller, or the right bracket to make it bigger, it's on the screen right now, and then just go around it like that, and as you can see, you won't smudge your skin. So again, I'll be back to you once I have finished it. So as you can see, I have finished it, let's go ahead and compare it to what it was like before. So I'm going to simply press the I which will remove the layer that I just edited on, and it's going to show us the previous layer. So let's see, look at that for a difference. So this is the normal image, as you can see all them spots everywhere, even the little two dimples here. And if we go ahead and press this again, that is the new image. As you can see, it's worked out very, very nice, and that was very quick. Now the next thing, you can simply just go file, save as and just save it to whatever you want to. So that is it for this video, thank you so much for watching, I hope this video has helped you. Like I said at the start of the video, if you would like to request a tutorial on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects, or even Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. With that being said, be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated when I'll be posting and what I'll be posting. Also be sure to go and check out my gaming channel, which I'm signing up pretty soon. And finally, be sure to go and add me on Snapchat or just see what I do throughout my day. So yeah, it's been Casual Savage here, thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, rate, and peace.